The Antonofen 225 cargo plane, also known as the Maria, was destroyed in the first hours of the Russian invasion of Ukraine in February 2022. The Maria was designed for aviation superlatives, with a carrying capacity of 250 tons, the longest wingspan of any active carrier, and six turbofan engines with more than 50,000 pounds of thrust each. The plane was refurbished by Antonov several times and began operating as a commercial venture in the early 2000s. The Maria transported various cargo, including satellites, transformers, and medical supplies during the COVID-19 pandemic. The destruction of the Maria occurred when elite Russian paratroopers descended on the Antonov airfield, which was supposed to be an anchor point to attack the capital, but Russian troops inside the airport were encircled, with no chance to bring in reinforcements quickly. The extent of the destruction became clear when Ukrainian forces retook the airport, and a joint investigation has been launched into the failure of the former head of the state-owned Antonov company to order the aircraft's planned evacuation to safety in Germany. Engineers and technicians have been scouring the wreckage of the Maria at Hostomel to pull out useful parts, and they will eventually remove one of its giant wings to try to restore it. The current plan is to use what they already have as the basis for a new plane, equipped with modernized engines and new electronic onboard equipment. The cost of rebuilding the plane is estimated to be close to a billion US dollars, and it won't be a top priority for a country shattered by war. Antonov executive Baikovets believes that rebuilding the plane should be done because it's a symbol of Ukraine, like the Burj Khalifa or Statue of Liberty.